In this video, I am going to tell you how to import alignments, how to import points into Civil 3D drawing related to an alignment. Currently in my drawing, I have an alignment here. I am going to import points into this drawing related to this alignment. That means the points are defined related to the stations on this alignment. This alignment is starting at 10 plus 500 station and it is going until around 11 plus 441 station. So the survey data is taken according to these stations. So let us see how to import the points uh, into Civil 3D based on the station and offset data. Uh, first we will look at how this data looks in a Excel file, the station uh, offset data. Here on my screen you can see I have the station data, then offset data, then elevation data and a description value here. Uh, so in my first here you can see at 10 plus 500 you are at station minus 6 that means the left side station I have elevation of 3.401 and the description is outside H. So likewise you have uh, several points at 10 plus 500 station. Uh, this point location varies by the offset. This zero offset means the center line. Then you have other offsets plus offset means the right side minus offset means the left side. So this is the uh, point, for, this is the station offset data file we have. But we cannot straight away import an Excel uh, data file into Civil 3D through alignment. Uh, the file type supported by Civil 3D is we call it ASCII file, or otherwise the common name is a text file. So we have we need to convert this Excel sheet into a text file. So to do that, you need to take these values without this raw file raw or header file, header row only the data into a uh, text file. So what I am going to do here is I am going to select these values. I have the station, first station, then offset, then elevation and finally the description. Uh, just remember the order station, offset, elevation and description. So I am going to select these things. Then I right click and click copy. Now I am going to create a uh, text file. Here in my uh, folder I am going to create a new text file here, text document. So I am I'm just leaving it as new text document. I open this one and right click and paste all the values here. Then what I need to do is I need to replace this tab because Excel gives us a tab in between the data. I need to replace this tab with a comma. So we'll, I will see. I will tell you what is what what is the purpose of doing this later. So at the moment I am going to replace these tabs with a comma. So I select this tab and select this one. Right click copy then go to edit replace and here I will paste the tab mark I will right click and control right click and paste then I will replace with the comma here so I will replace all the things here and click close here and you can see all the uh, Spaces or actually all the tabs are replaced by commas now. So I will close this one with by saving this one. Now I am going to my drawing. So this is my drawing. Uh, now what I am going to do is I am going to import those station offset data into this civil 3D alignment. So the data will be imported based on the alignment. To do that, go to home tab points. Points creation, go to create point on alignment, 
then go to import from file now move on to the file you have created currently i have moved to that file my uh, location automatically goes to that place so this is my, the new text document i created little while ago so i select this one and click open so after that it will asking for five six file types so you have to select what is the file type you have created in this uh, text file so we have created in the fifth file type that is station offset television and description so we have used that fifth file type so i have to type five here and press enter then it is asking what is the file format in in terms of space and comma so actually data gives the difference by a comma so i use the second option press enter so other than that one just leave this uh, invalid indicator for elevation and offset as same just press enter for those two options then it is asking to select alignment so i have to select this alignment so after some time it will import all the points into this drawing according to the station data so you can see all the points are now imported so if you let's us say you want to create section views from this uh, no, i am not going to tell you how to create the cross section views in this video but if you need to create section views just create a surface from these points from here create a surface from this point and create sample lines and add the surface data into the sample lines and create the section views then give it will give you the section views on these uh, point locations so usually we call it uh, we, are, we call it as creating initial cross sections so in the same manner if you have design data also you can create design cross sections in the same manner so that is how to import points onto a drawing related to an alignment